Hello Collectors, back again here Continuing my review on Classic Avengers series done by Kotobukiya Today I'm gonna bring you Hawkeye Fine Art Statue um, This is the color box And as you can see the full statue printed there Okay, now I'm gonna take this off And show you the piece In the styrofoam Okay, there you go. Um, it comes with six parts: the base, the Hawkeye statue, some arrows, and um, hand holding the bow. Okay, now I'm gonna try to assemble the parts and show you the full statue. Okay, now I'm gonna talk about the base first, like usual. From my opinion, Eric did an amazing job. Um, on the base very nice sculpted but I found the paint job very flat on this one um, this happened to most of Kotobukiya's base statues I said most of them not all of them um, the shadowing and weathering is very less on this one and I'm not a fan of this kind of paint job because I cannot tell between one rock to the other as you can see here there are some rocks on the base here um, here and here um, they painted uh, with the same um, color um, so that's why um, but the sculpt on the base was good um, the rocks are not flat I can see texturing on them um, I don't know if you can see it um, the sculpt itself is really nice here and here um, and they added an Ultron's head and arm as you can see here and here um, I think um, they did a nice touch on this one and I think also they should added this kind of props to their whole fine art base um, because they didn't do that because um, to me that whole base is a joke uh, but today I'm not gonna talk about that Hulk I will review that statue later um, now we move on to the statue first the pose as you can see it's a museum one um, I do like it and it match when we display him with another Avengers uh, fine art statue uh, from the same line uh, since most of them have museum pose anyway um, the scalp is good um, I like what Eric did on this one the proportion of the body looks great as you can see here he looks muscular um, you can see from the body here um, the scalp on his arms looks good with those muscles as you can see here and here as well um, and as well the legs um, I like it here and here I love the um, proportion and and the position of these legs on the rocks um, really good um, and the expression is not bad as well either uh, as you can see um, uh, he is very calm, I like it um, now the paint job I have pro and con on this one um, I'm gonna talk on the good one first um, the coloring is nice I see three purples here um, um, one for the boots here as you can see and one for the outfit um, It's a little bit pale purple they did on the outfit um, I like the purple on the boots better and one more is for the um, thing here um, he put the arrows in uh, it looks metallic and it's good though uh, I love what they did on those parts uh, weathering on the boots looks nice um, here and here as well 
um, as well the thing here for the arrow it looks metal once again I love it and for his uh, what do you call this a bracelet or something like that for this arm um, it looks metals um, once again I do like them um, the downside is the purple they use on the outfit looks uh, pale um, I said it before and I'm not a fan of it um, I believe uh, this purple color also used by Sideshow for their Hawkeye PF um, perhaps this is the original um, uh, color or of um, um, Hawkeye outfits but I'm not sure I wish Koto used the purple they did on the boots here for the outfit on the top here and for the straps as well and the belt um, but they didn't do that um, um, if they did that it would be great um, the downside number two is the armband that he's wearing here on the top here um, also here he has two of them um, left side and right side um, I don't know why Koto used the same purple uh, for the outfit on this one as well as you can see uh, they are as the same purple color um, from I know the armband is metal so um, they should use the part the purple uh, on this one to this one as well um, now um, we move on to the hand paint uh, from my opinion it looks good um, we know Hawkeye is white uh, he's Caucasian I don't want to see a brown is painted on his hand or arm um, because uh, shadowing or weathering on them uh, could make the statue uh, a bit darker um, um, they gonna mess up the paint job if they do that by uh, but uh, I'm glad they didn't do that um, um, as you can see on um, Batman uh, premium format done by Sideshow uh, the face uh, on that Batman is a bit darker so uh, most of collector said uh, he looks um, like um, Spanish people or something like that um, the 10 is too much and also the newest um, Iron Man Mark 42 maquette and by Sideshow the Tony Stark health sculpt um, it's too dark um, that's what happened if they did the uh, uh, skin tone um, darker um, it doesn't look uh, really nice at all uh, but um, I do like this uh, paint job on the arms uh, because he looks Caucasian once again uh, even though the um, muscle are not that pops but if you see this in person um, um you the muscle is there guys uh, the muscles uh, are there um it pops uh, but uh, when i when you see in this video maybe uh, they're not because um uh, i use a very bright light here so so you can see the statue clearly okay um i think that's my review on this Hawkeye Fine Art Statue done by Kotobukiya, sculpted by Eric Sosa. Um, if you have any questions, feel free to leave it. Um, it's a very fine statue. Um, it's really hard to find right now, even on eBay. Only one or two sellers um, selling it. Um, and the price is kind of high right now. I think it's about 350 to 400 bucks. Um, if you could get this uh, less than 350 um, it's a steal I think um, um, this is I think the only museum pose for Hawkeye statue um, other companies did Hawkeye already like Bowen uh, Heart Hero um, XM Studios and Sideshow Collectibles 
Um, they did one six and one four, um, and this is the only museum post uh, done by Kotobukiya and uh, other companies. I never did museum post, only this one. So it's really match when you display him with another um, statue from fine art line, uh, the Avengers one. Um, um, you cannot replace this statue with Bowen's uh, ha Hawkeye or Heart Heroes Hawkeye. They both have action pose. So this is the only one. Uh, it looks great when you display him next to Hulk, Thor, Iron Man, and Captain America done by Kotobukiya. Um, okay, um, that's my review on this one. Um, if you have any questions or comments feel free to leave it below uh, and now I'm gonna leave you with 360 Okay guys, um, that's my review, um, thank you for watching, I hope you enjoy it and help other people that wanted to buy this piece, um, once again it's a good one, um, thank you for watching once again, you will take care and have a good one, bye bye.